Next video, we have a Pexto video. And this is when rage baiters get humiliated. <sighs> I'm officially permanently banned from YouTube. To getting humiliated after crossing the line in public. Why? Get the what the f***? What the f This is so wrong! Here are seven rage bait YouTubers who went too know, far video, and as a result got what they deserve. It's Kevin Leonardo. <laughs> ...who went too far and as a result work, got what the they work, deserve. Man. Starting with the most infamous one, Master Ugwe, who would There's post so many rage bait dating. videos like... My didn't, he, didn't Kevin Leonardo make a video coming out about... Like how he likes little kids, or my trip time saying the n word. I'm Today, yeah. I'm going to be saying the n word for the first time in my life. You guys ready? Today, I'm going to be saying the n word for the first time. Neighbors. But while this was just bait, it didn't take long for okay. Ugwe to cross the line between trolling and racism. Since my grand, great, 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 great grandparents are slaves, I am allowed to say it as well. So. I'm gonna say- Bro's great 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 grandparents are not slaves. They probably were the ones that owned them, buddy. Unsurprisingly, viewers weren't happy. The reason he doesn't stop doing this is because- So he- he really said it this time? Unsurprisingly, viewers weren't happy. The reason he doesn't wow. stop doing this is because his six-year-old self-proclaimed dark humor-loving fans won't care if he does something different. Worse, this wasn't the only time Ugwe's content- So we're gonna risk ruining our career. ...landed him in trouble. On, on October 31st, 2023, the YouTuber got demonetized for hate- Aww. While he was re-monetized within days, six months later, Ugwe proved he had learned nothing from the experience. Uh, Hitler is my name. As expected, this had consequences. Well, that's it. My YouTube account with 7 mil subs and 500 mil views a month is gone soon because of a group of people spam reporting me. For I wonder why. Post yeah, an no. apology song. I'm sorry, sorry for saying me. Okay, yeah. This Sucks. But in Tyler, typical Master Uwe you? fashion, what even man, this it's apology was rage bait. I can't believe you guys got so upset. All I did was say the word. How are you doing? I'm doing good, man. How are you? This was the final straw, and on June 20th, 2024, the consequences of Uwe's actions caught up to him. Well, guys, Uwe. I'm officially permanently banned from YouTube. You, now, the YouTuber chases his former glory on his only unbanned channel, Uplay Reborn, words? where his shorts average just 4,000 views. Damn. Wah, 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 wah. But while Ugwe got in trouble for using racial slurs, controversial gotcha creator Bella the Wolf took things a step further, disrespecting Jesus and God. On August 11th, 2024, Bella would somehow... A gotcha life? Where disrespecting people's religion with a gotcha life character get over 800,000 views on her video i got Matt rid of Holmes jesus along with some passionate mm -hmm. comments should we ban her yes yes as a christian this is extremely hurtful how mocking much, jesus how is a serious no-no and 11 days later she posted a disturbing apology shipping muslims and jesus but religion wasn't the only thing bella mocked she also made fun of dead how old is this behind the screen. Including the beloved Minecraft YouTuber Technoblade. And if that wasn't bad enough, Bella's next move destroyed all chances of redemption. Of Bella the wolf put my son, and here he is, that's oh. Mouse, put Mouse's number on a Discord server, said that it was hers, and told people to call. Wow. There was voicemails and name? text messages saying like the N-word with the N-I-G-G Thanks to Bella's actions, Roblox streamer Steak announced a live public trial. Your honorary Steak Wad presides over the case. Bella, fatherless wolf, damn, versus the people of YouTube. And on August 3rd, 2024, he streamed his decision. Your honorary Steak Wad hereby sentence you one Discord call. Which pet god? The sentence was carried out 22 days later. Not you dirty, disgusting, religion hating, rage baiting, shitty gotcha edit creating, and other name violating, looking ass Since then, Bella wow. has posted another apology. Hello. Ew, is this horror? Holy sh. Jump scare? Bella the Wolf here. I want to sincerely apologize for recent behavior. 
which has caused significant harm and distress. But when a viewer asked, my dad was in the Iraq war. He almost died because of a bomb. Are you going to laugh and make fun about that, Bella? Her response made it obvious she was never sorry. Although we're pack gods... Perhaps. That Bella? Her response made it what obvious that, she was never sorry. Trash Although we're pack like gods sent Bella you? packing, that vegan teacher, real name Katie Karen Diekmeyer, dug her grave with eschewal comments about a child. Shortly after her infamous beef what with Gordon did? Ramsay, Katie would bait the internet once again and with her, her video, her face Are face You face Racist? Does this girl gonna, seem to you like she might be naturally crazy. intelligent? That's crazy! Gorgeous, generous, exemplary, and radiant? She looks like she could be that to me. And wow. Bad enough, two years later, Katie took things a step further. Hello? God? Listen, I I've been wanting to say something to you. Heaven hotline and she's using a banana. For a long time now. Like, there's this one thing that you did that it's just really pissed me off. I don't understand why you created lions to eat zebras. Like, why would you do that? You're sorry. I know, I know it was a long time ago. You've been trying Yo, to undo it. Oh, oh, it's okay. It, it, it's okay. Don't cry. It's all in our hands now. People like me have to save the world. And while Katie admitted she does this for attention, her notoriety soon bit her back. There was a gang of teenage girls who looked at me and they all went, oh my God, it's that vegan teacher. And so I quickly got back on my bike. I just waved to them and I just left. I left because I don't want to always be that big a teacher. Sometimes I just want to be a normal person in my name. Oh, well, that's too damn bad. Neighborhood. Still, she refused to change for the better. The baby is enjoying the barbecue sauce, which is vegan. If this had been somebody's penis covered in sauce, the child would have had the same reaction. The what? that in your gut leaving viewers disgusted i said like, what the f out loud that? about six times what she said is so disgusting deep platform what? right now this I'm is the worst you, ish i've ever heard in my life soon after the video was mass reported and taken down since Good. then katie She's gets weird. barely 5,000 views on her videos despite which she needs zero views they need to take her channel completely down completely unaware of what's wrong with her content unlike one giant onion She's ignorant. rage baits would be much more you would think with how fucking old this bitch is this bitch looks like she's pushing at least 70. she would know why her content is making people upset on February 12, 2024, so if you one giant onion, or, or all of them, would post a concerning vent, video I'm titled, How to. to Finger a Minor. They all became Hello? As the A minor chord, I don't have a real guitar, but... I Why would you make that your title? Right and this I video was far from the only one on his channel, but on June 9th, 2024... Right and this video was far... How many genders are there in Word Speedrun? And coming out, I'm gay. Far from the only one on his channel. But on June 9th, 2024, Oliver seemed to come to a realization. I almost blur. have a million subscribers. But honestly, I'm tired of shit posting. I'm going to do my best to be a better YouTuber and actually start posting content that benefits people. He started making longer commentary ass, style buddy. videos, which his fans loved. Onion entering his video essay YouTuber arc. Unfortunately well, for his audience, Oliver's redemption part. arc was short lived, and just two months later, the YouTuber returned to his usual brain. Uh -oh. rot content so today i tried sucking my own pee and um that's a crazy way to open up the video i was successful and i want to tell you guys exactly what happened and understandably his viewers were he not happy this is not wow. the content we wanted now okay. oliver's views have been dropping with his most recent video w? only getting 8,000 views much like youtube's weirdest rage baiter kevin leonardo oh, who God. used makeup as a Hello? Mock black people. On May 8th, 2024, Kevin would try out Korean brand Euphoria's controversial darkest foundation. It's very... You're not dark skin. In what world would you need to try out the darkest foundation? Very dark, as you can see. Ooh, this shade, like, literally looks offensive so far. But Kevin didn't stop there. That's not up to you to... Say if it's offensive or not. Darkest of blacks would get called out for cultural appropriation if they wore this. Worse, it was clear Kevin knew what? exactly. Called out for cult No, they wouldn't. Clear Kevin knew exactly what he was doing. I feel like Wait, I literally would get in trouble for like. Call. I was just saying, if you ever need anything, I'm always Especially here. once he admitted he doesn't normally wear makeup. I don't wear makeup, so like there was no. So then, why the fuck did you want to test the world's darkest shades? Wear makeup also, for a video, crazy. but this today is I was like, us. yes, a new scandal. 
I can hop on that. As expected. A scandal is not for you! Like, what do you mean you want to hop on a new scandal? The only reason it was a scandal is because a woman, a dark-skinned woman, tried out the foundation. Or maybe it wasn't this specific foundation, but there was a foundation that, um, her name is Gloria, was trying out, and that shit looked terrible. It just looked like they just took black face paint and put it in a foundation. It didn't take long for the internet to this show him loser. some love. Why are you so obsessed with black people? Stop commodifying us for views. But one comment stood out. This guy seems like he laughed at a racist meme in middle school and never moved past that yeah. face, which Bro's wasn't weird. far from the truth. The N-word was a part of my daily vocab up until I was like 19, but never would I ever like Post it. Despite this, Kevin still argued he'd done nothing wrong. Black Americans need to calm down. Dude. They need to what? Like, cancel me for putting on Euphoria's foundation because I'm like, quote unquote, racist. And while. Because you, quote unquote, are. You're not even dark skin. You're not dark skin. You're not brown skin. You're not even light skin. In what world? You're not black. In what world did you need to try out the foundation? He did post an apology. I promise you, I was not doing blackface. I don't even yes, think like blackface were. is even funny in general. The damage yeah. was already done. His views falling from millions to less than 100,000 per video. However, where Kevin only lost viewers, vegan activist Vegan Booty, or Tash uh -oh. Peterson, would get humiliatingly arrested for her actions. On February 19th, uh -oh. 2020, Tash would go to an Australian woman's football event. But unlike other spectators, she chicken. wasn't there to watch the game. Bearing a right to rescue oh. flag, she was promptly wow. removed from the stadium and fined $1,800 for trespassing. Damn. Despite all okay. this, Tash only doubled down on her actions. It's an important game for them, and but yeah, I don't apologize. Would you do it all again? Yes. 100%. So and three years she, later, she did like, something similarly or? unhinged at a children's pony oh. party. Stop teaching your children animal slavery is okay! This is blatant animal abuse and exploitation! Okay. Do they look happy to you standing here having children in their faces and riding on their backs? The video was heavily criticized. The horses are only uncomfortable because you're yelling at their faces. But Tash didn't weird. learn her lesson. I actually measure my own success by the amount of haters and criticism that I have. Mm. And a year and a half That's later, she good. stooped even lower. Every year in Australia. Yo! Over one million male bobby calves are murdered in the dairy industry. The baby girls endure the same life of- I think there was a way to like get your point across without you being naked. Or having your titties out, buddy. Slavery repeated This time, however, she finally got proper consequences. Why? W. What the- What the- this is so wrong! When police arrived on the uh -uh. scene, Tash was dragged away. Her continued protests falling on deaf ears. It's disgusting what they just did to him. You know better. Right. It's not your first rodeo. And while Tash still refuses to stop, she certainly destroyed her chances of a respectable YouTube career. Oh yeah. But unlike Tash... She's not making a difference in the slightest bit. Ash, who only got arrested, streamer Johnny Somali uh -oh. is now facing up to 10 I years in him. prison for his rage bait content. On October 7th, 2024, Johnny would kiss South Korea's Statue of Peace, which was a big problem as the statue represented young girls forced into actual slavery by the Japanese military. Sure. A fact that Johnny was well aware of. My God, yo, this is what I was looking for. Actually? Yeah. Still, Johnny didn't stop, and it turned all South Koreans against him even further when he Dancing on the statue is crazy. Didn't bother stopping an offensive donation. Banzai, 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 senko, five no, 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 Translating to Long Live the Emperor, Tenahaiko Banzai was a Japanese battle cry used against Koreans during World War II. The reminder of Japan's oppressive regime got people angry. Except wow. now that it got the reaction he wanted, Johnny faked innocence. I don't know, Banzai! But Johnny's luck was running out, and on October 17th, 2024, he picked a f This is not Solo's brother. Do not put him in Sala's name fight in the he same would regret. Sentence. Drinking alcohol at a store until a worker stopped him, Johnny then threw ramen on his table and at other customers and got aggressive when confronted. This was the final straw and less than 10... In what world did he think any of this was okay? Later, Johnny was in police custody and banned from leaving the country. And while he tried to MGD's apologize... So to all the people of South Korea, 
Uh, I just want to apologize for what I've done, and I really did not mean to hurt you guys. Too fucking, too fucking bad and too fucking late. Pride this much. I hope that I can live in peace here in South Korea, and we could uh, nope. get past the situation and use it as a learning situation. Because a lot of people learned about this statue from this situation, bad or good. A lot of people from all over the world found out what this was a lame apology? from my action. Gross. This Disgusting. was far from sincere. He's, loser, He's gonna bro. come up to me, bro. Uh, why are you being racist to other people in other countries? For money. For clout. I have no morals. I'm a fucking sociopath. Oh, now, we can tell. the streamer is under investigation on charges of misdemeanor, business obstruction, okay. drug possession, mm -hmm. and more with a potential sentence of up to 10 years in prison. Love it. And I hope that's what he gets sentenced to.